Hello friends, this is Jalpesh here and welcome again to my channel Code with Jay. Uh, in this video, we are going to learn about the uh, Visual Studio Code extension error lens and we are going to see what are the features it, it is providing and see how uh, it, it is useful in our day-to-day -day life as a developer. So let's directly jump into the Visual Studio Code. You know Visual Studio Code is my favorite ID and uh, most of the things uh, I write code in Visual Studio Code itself. So like this is a extension which I am going to talk about like it is built from uh, by Aaron Alexander and like it was uh, a fork of the another uh, repo but now this guy is maintaining all these tabs. So basically like what it does is like it improves the highlighting of the Visual Studio Code errors uh, highlighting. So basically it, it gives uh, um, uh, highlighting like uh, this here you can see and like and provide some meaningful descriptions of the error like missing semicolon and other stuff and uh, it also shows like few things in the gutters where the icon is there so let's directly jump into the code itself so basically what i am going to do is like here you can see like this is a angular app so here what i have done is like uh, i have uh, imported the console reporter from jasmine like jasmine is a test framework for angular so in the component we are not going to use this thing so here you can see like uh, like it is giving me the error so here that's how like you can get uh, the error and if i remove this uh, then like that error will be gone another thing uh, which i wanted to uh, show you is uh, is the uh, return type so it, uh, if you can see like this is a button click event and like it is void so you cannot return any type so if i try to return any type let's say i'm returning true so here you can see like true is not assignable to type void it's giving me that error because the thing is that like you cannot return types with the void functions so if i write and type type uh, return like this then the error will be gone same way if i write something uh, after the uh, return statement like let's say hello wall so here you can see like i am getting warning that unreachable code is uh, detected because uh, my compiler will return from here so this call will this code will never be executed so like you can see uh, uh, it is a very useful ex extension and you get all the errors on the fly and builds help me reduce um, the errors uh, in the code which i write and like it improves my productivity as well as like it saves my time by removing the error in, uh, whenever we write the code so i hope you like this video there and like don't worry about the extension link uh, i am going to put uh, that extension link into the my description of this video and if you like this kind of video then please do subscribe to my channel code with jerry here is the url for that and uh, i hope to see you in the next video thank you for watching this video